Hi there, I'm Elizabeth Holmes of the Wall Street Journal, and this is how you get a berry lip like Jessa from Girls. Girls is my favorite show on TV, and it's proof that beauty comes in all shapes and sizes. While I might be most like Marnie in real life, there's no denying the fantastic berry lip on Jessa, played by Jemima Kirk. She rocks the ultimate boho chic look. To learn how to get our own, we've come to Sephora in New York City, and we're turning to pro lead artist, Gilbert Solis, hi. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing good. So I'm a huge fan of girls, and I love this berry lip trend that we've seen everywhere. So where do we start with this? So for our first step, we're gonna use Bite's Line and Define Lip Primer. You want to apply a generous amount of the primer to the entire surface of the lip. What this is going to do is fill in any texture, fine line, and ensure long-lasting results. And after that, we're going to use Makeup Forever's Lip Line Perfector. Now this goes along the perimeter of the lip, because we don't want lipstick to feather, especially when you're working with deep, dark, or even reds. Um, that's the worst thing. Okay. And this is just clear. Again, it's filling in those tiny fine lines so that your lipstick doesn't start to travel. And now you're ready for your lipstick application. So exciting. So now we're gonna apply Sephora Collection Lip Glass Lipstick number 22, Burgundy Spirit. I love it, this is the money, right? Sure is. So you apply it with a brush. With a lip brush. You know, when, you, when you're working with a deeper, darker, bold color. When you utilize a lip brush, it really allows you to control the amount of coverage that you put on, so women can ease their way into the color. Because okay. if you would apply it straight from the lipstick tube, you'd get like full coverage, really opaque. A lot. A lot. So picking up some of the color with your lip brush, and then applying it to the center of the lip, and then blending your way out. And I love these Sephora Collection Lip Glass lipsticks. Lots of pigment and really long durability. So you're gonna get long wear. So now that we've done your lip, we can move on to your eyes. Okay. Because we want to balance that out. We're gonna give you this sort of sultry, sort of worn in look that Jessa has. Jessa has, yeah. yeah. So we're gonna use Kat Von D's. The color is called Puro Amor, and it's like a charcoal, it's black. Okay. Um, what you wanna do is keep this really close to your lash line. We're gonna start with your with the lower part of your eye. So look up for me. Working from the outer corner, you're getting it really close to your lash line. And what's great about these pencils is on the other end, there's a little smudge tip so you can go in and just smudge it right along the lash line. And I think, you know, the idea behind this is it doesn't have to be perfect. You want it to sort of look a bit worn in. It looks a bit more sexy. Close. And then we're going to take it right on top of the lash line. Concentrating a bit more on the outer corners of the eye. Flipping the pencil around. A gentle smudge. There you go. Oh, I love it. Super sexy. Just like Jessa. Thank you so much. You're welcome. For more tips, tricks, and the latest style news, keep it at youtube.com slash WSJ. You can find me on Twitter at eholmeswsj. It's like a drink of water for your face. Gosh, who doesn't need that? That's awesome. Okay, so these are all once a week too? And a great little pro tip here is you want to find a shade that's really close to your natural lip color.